Uh, hi everyone, welcome to Social Work 622. This is the field internship course. Um, I just wanted to post a quick uh, introductory video, um, and I realize I'm putting it in week two. Uh, the reason for that is that you get so much information sort of sent your way in week one, <clears throat> and the, the field class is a little bit different than other classes. I wanted to wait till um, uh, sort of the coursework stuff was out of the way so that we could talk about some of the, the field, uh, the, the particularities of, of uh, the field course here. So I'm giving it to you in, uh, in, in week two. Um, real quick, um, my name is Brad Lynn. Uh, you're, you may have seen uh, my full name uh, somewhere, Braden, uh, but I go by Brad. You're welcome to call me Brad. Uh, you're also welcome to call me Dr. Lynn if you prefer. I know on um, I know on uh, D2L it says Mr. Lin, um, the, and that would you can you can call me that too. That would be fine. Uh, the reason for that is that I started teaching for Edinburgh maybe six or seven, five or six years ago now, probably six years ago, uh, when I was still a PhD student. So at that point it was a you know my name was Mr. Lin, uh, and and just with everything going on, I, I haven't updated the Mr. to Doctor. It's really not a big deal. It's kind of low on my priority list anyway. Uh, and like I said, you're welcome to call me Brad. Uh, um, that did, uh, that's absolutely fine. Um, this uh, our, our course is sort of fully um, uh, fully asynchronous, uh, but I do have uh, kind of a virtual office hour policy. Um, so you're welcome to call my cell phone uh, seven days a week, nine a.m. to nine p.m. Um, the number is uh, is uh, on the screen there. It's also on the syllabus five eight five seven five zero seventy three two eight. Uh, I would ask that you don't text. I'll, I'll say why in a second. But uh, call anytime, 9 a.m. to 9 p.m. Um, I will answer if I'm able to. Um, so if I'm not in another class or I'm not in a meeting. If I don't answer, leave a message and I'll call you back. I typically don't call back after 9 o'clock if it, if, um, you know, if you call in the evening and it, it you know, it, it's getting pretty close to 9, I'd probably call the next day. Um, it just, you know, 9 p.m. seems a little, you know, uh, after 9 p.m. seems a little late. I don't want to wake anyone up or, you know, uh, disrupt uh, anything. Um, if you are in um, a different time zone, I'm in the eastern time zone. If you're in the, a different time zone, uh, I'm well, I, I'm happy to talk outside of those hours. Um, we can arrange something. We can also arrange Zoom appointments, uh, any, anything that you want. Um, the reason that I ask for um, for students not to text is um, that texting is really an informal form of communication. It's something we do with friends, with family members. And part of our job here as MSW students is to cultivate sort of a professional identity. So, um, so I would ask that we stick with sort of professional forms of communication, uh, phone calls, um, Zoom meetings, you know, as needed, uh, and then certainly you're welcome to email me or post on D2L in the questions tab. Um, I check email uh, at least once a day. Oftentimes it's much, much more than that. I check it at least once on the weekends. Typically it's much more than that. Uh, and I check D2L at least once a day, usually more, but, it, but at least once a day. So I'm very easy to get a hold of. Uh, and my job really in this um, in this class is to get you through uh, or support you as you get through your uh, your field hours. Um, I'm a resource. I'm here to liaise between you and the university, you and your field placement. Um, if if uh, it, hopefully this doesn't happen, but if there's any problems, I'm I'm here to you know to sort of be a resource for you and support you. Um, so uh, I am happy to talk about anything related to field. Field is such a fun and interesting part of social work education. Um, <clears throat> it's also, uh, it also can be really challenging and it, it is particularly challenging sort of in this, in this, um, this sort of COVID world that we find ourselves in. So please absolutely think of me as a resource. Uh, I, I will be, um, uh, you know, like I said, I'm happy to talk about any problems um, you're having with field or anything, you know, anything that you want to, uh, that you want to talk about. Um, so uh, a week, uh, quote unquote, a week in our course runs from uh, Monday to Sunday. Um, new content opens up Monday. Um, you know, that's when sort of a new field week starts. Week runs until Sunday. Uh, field placements begin in week five. Um, and then after that, it's sort of a field week, class week pattern. Um, and there's, um, you know, a, certain, a couple of assignments and things like that for you to, uh, to attend to. 
uh, information is in the syllabus and in, and in D2L. As I said if, before, if you have any questions, get in touch with me. Uh, we'll do two site visits. We can do them by phone or over Zoom. Um, we will arrange those individually in a couple of weeks uh, as, as we get a little bit closer. Last thing I want to talk about real quick, obviously COVID has disrupted the world uh, rather significantly. Um, I, it is my sincere hope that we don't have any problems with COVID, but in, but I just want to talk about what would happen if we were to have some, some, some COVID issues. Um, so first of all, uh, if, if I should get sick, uh, someone from the department would step in and sort of take over for me. Um, if, if you get sick, please let me know. Um, um, we have certain accommodations we can make and there are certain sort of scheduling adjustments that uh, that we can make but I need to know so that we can sort of activate that that planning process um, hopefully it doesn't come to that most um, um, you know most COVID illnesses are, are, are pretty uh, mild but we also have no ability to sort of um, predict you know how, how severe it's going to be so like I said my my genuine hope is that we don't have any problems, but um, we just, you know, we can't say that with, with any certainty. If things have to be shut down because of COVID, um, we will continue to be able to make progress towards ours. Um, there might be some disruption, there might be some delays, but we should be able to continue to make progress towards ours and, you know, academic progress and things like that. If that is the case, get in touch with me. Um, and keep an eye on D2L, keep an eye on your, your email. That's how I'm going to be communicating with you. That's how the school and field, the field department is going to be communicating with you and things like that. Uh, I also know that we're all sort of in different places. Uh, I'm in, in Buffalo, New York. We've got students uh, sort of all over the, the country. So um, it's entirely possible that things sh sort of shut down at, at different, you know, at different spots. Um, or you know, shut down to different different degrees in, uh, in in different parts of the country. So again, if that happens and your field placement is is disrupted, get in touch with me. Like I said, we will activate sort of that um, um, the alternative, you know, whatever we're going to call it, the alternative uh, planning kinds of things. Um, so uh, so I'll leave it for there. Thank you, uh, thank you for watching. Uh, I'm very excited about our uh, our work together and to to get to know. Uh, each one of one of you. Okay, talk soon. Bye bye.